So, Doctor. Uh, Bean. Yes, okay, Dr. Bean. Uh, well, you, you, you made it. Nice flight. <laughs> well, this is Kevin. Oh. And this is Jennifer. She's been very excited about meeting you. Uh-huh. My wife, Allison. Oh. David, could I just have the tiniest talk with you in the kitchen? All right, yeah. Just go. I appreciate that on first viewing, he seems a little eccentric. David, there are Martians who have been exiled from Mars for looking weird, who look less weird than this guy. He has an original quality. He goes time, today. Wow, that was amazing. It's really cool. Hey, can you do this? Oh, no, but I can do this. Neat! Wow! How do you do that? Oh, magic. Okay, do. so you're gonna tell yes. him today? Yes, today, today, okay. today. Today seems like a good, good. day. things with uh, a man of your caliber to, to be normal. I, I gotta confess, I've never actually read anything you've written. Uh, tell me, Doctor, what exactly is your position at the gallery? I sit in the corner and look at the paintings. Ah! That is brilliant! If only more scholars would do that, you know, just sit and look. You know, not lecture and write and argue. Just sit and look at the paintings themselves. Now, that is brilliant. Yeah. Yes. Morning, Elmer. Good morning, sir. Dr. Bean? Oh. You'd like to sign in, sir? Thank you. Welcome to the Grayson, Dr. Bean. Welcome to my world. We were expected in Grierson's office at 9 a.m. Now, this is a man who does not like to be kept waiting. So if you... Oh, yeah, okay, absolutely. You bet. All right. Thank <laughs> you. 
We should make a move. We're very light. Mm. Oh, we, he, doctor, we, if, you, if when you're ready. Okay. David, finally. And this must be our professor from across the sea. Yes, George Grierson. This is Dr. Bean. I'm delighted, Doctor. Oh. <laughs> Actually, I'm... I'm Dr. Bean, let me get a photo, Bean. please, sir. Yeah. Right there. We've heard a great deal about you, Doctor. Thank you, gentlemen. expect a great deal of you. And this is Bernice, in charge of PR. An absolute honor, Doctor. All right, thank you. And Walter Huntley, our merchandise manager. Nice to meet you. Moving along. Take a seat, Doctor. You. Here, let me take that old thing. Oh. This is very out of date. Thank you. Before we settle in, you might want to feast your eyes on these. I'll be honest with you, Bean. I like this. It's it's beautiful, sir. Mm. I, I, it mm. is, yeah. Mm. yeah. Mm. Uh, over here. Okay. Yeah, it's a lovely green there. Oh, good, good. Done okay. business. Okay. I've asked Bernice to run through the order of events for the opening. Uh, Dr. Bean, would you like to join us? Uh, uh, no, uh, no, I'll just... Uh, uh, very well. Bernice? Now, you will note that anything pertaining to special media requirements is prefixed with an asterisk, mm -hmm. i.e. glossy stills requested by some of the favored weeklies, that sort of thing. Right. So, the big day unfolds as follows. Our generous benefactor, General Newton, will be arriving at 10 a.m. to meet the members of the staff. Then at 10.30, we'll have the unveiling of the picture. Now, this will be in front of all press and media. Uh, Walter, I'm assuming all this merchandising is going to be made available. Oh, absolutely. From fridge magnets to frisbees, we'll be ready. So, it will probably be at about 11 a.m. when the stage is set for Dr. Bean. Oh, yes. All right. Really really should bring in the doctor here. Uh, Dr. Bean? Doctor, we've just been inspecting the schedule and if you would just like to take a look at yours right over there at your convenience. Uh, the general should be arriving at 10 a.m. and he'll unveil the picture at 10.30. So at about 11 o'clock, we should be um, ready for your speech. Yes, and uh, I think uh, 20 minutes should, should be long enough. Don't you, Bernice? Absolutely. I know you could fill hours, doctor, but for the press, it would be best if you could keep it quite light. Maybe throw in some anecdotes about the actual painting of the picture uh, and explain why it is considered to be America's greatest painting. <laughs> it's, uh, is that going to be enough, uh, Doctor? 20 minutes? <laughs> well, dear friends, if you'll excuse me, I have a lunch with the mayor. Not the kind of thing I like, but duty calls. Well, Doctor, it's good to meet you. <laughs> it's a complex experience. <laughs> Enjoy your stay with David. They're simple people, but warm. David, if I may have just a private word. Okay. Uh, I tell you, why don't you wait for me back at the new acquisitions? I'll join you shortly. Oh. Yeah. Yes. He's a genius, right? Yeah, he's, he's eccentric. Mm. But, yes. Yeah. 
The unveiling of Whistler's mother is the most important thing to ever happen to this gallery. And Dr. Bean was your choice. Yes, I understand that. Thank you, sir.